Jack hasn't even got three grosh in these days. None of this would be happening if we had a king. And I mean a real one, not Wenceslas or Sigismund. Oh, anywhere that's not ruled by a strong hand, all sorts of things go wrong. Especially when you've got Moravian relatives eating you out of house and home. Hold up. This is strange. I don't see any cart tracks. What do you reckon, Gnarly? I'm blind as a mole, sir. But it's all peculiar right enough. Where the hell could that cart have vanished to? Well, that's just it. They had nowhere to turn off. I look up the road a bit. And you, Henry, have a look back along the road. Maybe it fell in a ditch somewhere. Who knows? Very well, sir. The blacksmith's cart. And someone went to a hell of a lot of trouble to hide it from the road. Hey! I found the blacksmith's cart! Come here! Well, now, here we have it. The blacksmith's cart. We'll carry on, but on foot. My old young milker would only break a leg there. And keep a sharp lookout. Something stinks here. I told you, they got ambushed by the bastards on the road. Oh, Apollonia. I spent a lot of time running around here. Oh, not me. This place always gave me the shivers. God's truth. I ain't got only good memories of it. One time, got my legs stuck in a crevice a bit further on. Trapped there all night I was. Shitting myself with fear. It wasn't till morning that the folk from the fortress found me. The whole of Samin was out looking for me. See, at least you came here as a kid. It still gives me the creeps here. Why is that, sir? It's just some rocks, ain't it? You'd sing a different tune if you had to run away. I'm sorry. Headless horsemen, goblins, and white ladies. Every night, we'd gather by the hearth. The old woman would sit at her spinning wheel, telling stories. And I'll tell you, Captain. Shh! Listen. Yeah, I hear it. There's somebody there, sure enough. Let's get closer. Stumble's a priest. He can't even quote one psalm. Don't you think he'd have a better nickname than Stumble if he was a priest? Hey, it ain't his fault. What's wrong with his legs? What's wrong with his legs is, they can't stay away from the tavern. You two don't know the truth from an hole in the ground. Stumble was a priest. He showed me all these pictures and taught me a lot. Huh? What do we do now? I heard more than two voices. I used to clamber around here as a young lad. The girls from Slatigo used to come make a fire here and jump over it. And so as their underwear wouldn't catch fire. Sometimes they'd take it off. That's nice, Gnarly, but I don't think it's scantily clad maidens we'll be running into here. So what's that got to do with anything? Well, there's a nice view into the gorge from up there. 
We only have to go back a bit, then we can get up there nicely. Right. Henry, what are you waiting for? This is just the kind of thing we took you along for. Sure, sir. With a bit of luck, there might be some girls there, too. I can do without girls with voices like that. Now get going. Light up in the dark. They rolled around and gave off sparks. Hi, <laughs> sparks. <laughs> you two are arseholes. I'd have nothing to do with a wench like that. It ain't right having a pair like that. Hmm. She might be hexed. Those definitely aren't witch. blacksmith's hands. You see hexes everywhere. It ain't that strange. Even my uncle had a pair. I'll kill you. We're I'll gonna get you, you. you. Uh. I'll slice you! Uh, Amen to you! Uh, now you're going to... Get it! Uh, I'll be done uh, with you in a flash! Show your stuff! Uh, Take that! I'll rip your arse open! Stop dawdling! <laughs> 